With less than three months to the Tokyo Olympics, a state of emergency in Tokyo is putting plans in jeopardy. Japan's Prime Minister says the final decision rests with the International Olympic Committee and local organizers are pressing ahead with test events. Michio Ishida with more. With less than three months to go, organizers are still working out the safest way to hold the Tokyo Games amid a raging pandemic. It will be an unprecedented experience for not just the athletes. At this test event in Tokyo, the working space for the press was divided into several rooms. No food was served to prevent any droplets. Where the best of the best compete, reporters naturally form large groups in their attempts to interview the winners. But with COVID-19, that would be unwise. Organizers are trying to find a workaround. It's for the first time since the COVID-19 pandemic that a mixed zone has been set up at an international sporting event. As you can see, this is an area where the athletes and the press mingle. The athletes walk through this area immediately after their competition. Most have to catch their breath, unable to wear their masks. The rule is, if you are to stop them for a short interview, you should do so with a distance of two meters. For athletes, the summer games are expected to be a quieter affair. Aside from up-tempo music, recorded cheers were played during track races. If it were not for the COVID-19 pandemic, this stadium would have been filled with spectators. But until the 11th of May, Tokyo has decided not to allow any fans into sporting events. Tokyo is currently under its third state of emergency since the pandemic began as Japan struggles to stem out a new wave of infections. American sprinter Justin Gatlin was one of few foreign athletes running in the test event. This competition here was a precursor to, to see exactly how you know, uh, the Olympics can go off, uh, uh, maintaining a bubble for the athletes to be able to stay healthy and also the citizens of Japan to be able to stay healthy with foreign athletes, foreign athletes coming into the country. Um, I think it was a success, um, de definitely different. 420 athletes took part in this Olympic test event in Tokyo. Only nine were from overseas. They were exempted from a 14-day quarantine, but their movements were confined as requested by organizers. Come July, Tokyo will face the real test, it will host thousands of athletes from around the world, and all of them will be required to go through stringent COVID-19 countermeasures, including daily coronavirus tests. Michio Ishida, CNA, Tokyo.